Hey everybody, what's up? It's Nick here, and in today's video, I'm going to bring you guys a video showing you guys about a cool theme for your iPod Touch or iPhone that is jailbreaking, which is going to be the Google Nexus S theme. So as you guys can probably tell here on my iPod Touch, I have a different theme right now. It has a sort of Nexus S kind of looking theme on it. As you notice, it's got the live wallpaper, and it's got the cool little icons for the Nexus S on it, and it's pretty much an Android kind of skin for your iPod Touch or iPhone. Now you can get this theme by going into Cydia and searching for Nexus S theme. I believe I'll have a picture on the side here showing you guys what it'll look like in Cydia just because Cydia takes forever to load up and I don't want to show you guys that. So just go and download that through Cydia and you can install it by downloading Winterboard. So all you need is you need to have Winterboard. As you can see here I have a Winterboard right here. Just launch up your Winterboard and then just go to select themes and then as you see here mine is gingerbread 2.3 or the nexus s one i don't know why i have the battery percentage one on because that is not working but pretty much once you have the gingerbread 2.3 one launched up you will close out of that and then you will have this nexus s live background and you'll have the android kind of icons so as you notice the icons look really cool you have the special icon for music safari the app store and all these other stock icons here they even changed the city icon and the badges and the cool thing about this uh, moving wallpaper around here is that it's actually a loop it's not just a video it's just a background loop the only problem with it is you can't touch the screen and it won't boop and like beep around like the normal Nexus wallpaper and uh, I wanted it to do that because my friend just got an HTC Evo 4G and I love playing around with the background but this doesn't work but at least the background looks so cool on it and so not only did it skin the icons in the wallpaper it skinned the top bar up here as you see here we have a little Android up here and a little uh, Wi-Fi meter and uh, whoops and a little battery percentage marker if we scroll over here as you notice, we still have the standard keyboard, but we do have a different kind of bar up here to search for stuff. And it doesn't change all the icons. I believe it changes every icon that comes stock on iOS, except for the calendar and the clock. These other apps are apps that I added myself. And anyway, it also comes with a custom lock screen, so if I lock the lock screen and I unlock it, as you notice, it comes up with sort of a Android 2.3 looking kind of lock screen. As you notice, the uh, volume button here doesn't do anything, but the lock button does that. And I'm talking really weird when I'm presenting this. But anyway, it's really cool, and it also skins all the inside stuff. So I believe if I go to Safari, it changes to browser, as you can see here. And it has sort of the browser. And as you notice, I'm on jailbreakme.com, which is how I jailbroke my iPod Touch. And uh, it has back and forward buttons like this. It has the screen buttons like this. Looks like that. It even has a done button that's green. It has the menu buttons that look like this. And pretty much that's it for the browser. I gotta uh, clear my throat for a second. <clears throat> Sorry about that. It skins the App Store too. As you notice, it's changed to Android Market. And uh, it's gonna load up because I've got the slowest iPod Touch in the world. Would you like to download your free copy of iBooks? No, not now. It's got this uh, skin on the app store, as you notice up here. It even changed the menu bar, or the top bar, to white instead of black. And you get all these uh, cool things on here. I've got an update for my Oosphora app, which I will download later. And let me just close out of that. And it even, like, skins everything. Like, I believe it skins notes, too. And uh, it skins settings, too. As you can see here, settings is really skinned just takes forever to load up because I've got the slowest iPod touch in the world and it, notice it makes everything green and it makes it all look like Android 2.3 and there's many different other things that the skin does but however that is basically just the basics of it and the reason that I like it is I like the icons and I like the moving wallpaper now I'm not an Android fan or an Android freak or anything I just like the way Android looks but I really do like my iPod touch and my iPhone 4 but anyway, that is the uh, Nexus S skin for the iPhone in the iPod Touch that is jailbroken. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want to download it, you can download it from Cydia. So yeah, so thanks a lot for watching, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys next time. And if you have anything else you want to see, feel free to leave it in the comment section below. And once again, I'll see you guys in the next video. See ya.